percentages, day 4. Determining the original value. A certain store adds 45% profit to all its products. If the price on the on the tag of a frying pan is 290 rand, what was its cost price? Now the cost price is the price that the owner of the store originally paid for it. And on top of that, the um, owner of the store want to earn some profit. So therefore they have a, a profit that they will add, in this case 45%, to all its products. Okay, so the cost price is 100%. The selling price is 100% plus the percentage profit. So in this case, 100% plus 45% is 145%. Okay, now to calculate the selling price, we will do the opposite of what we did in example 2, method 2 of day 2's lesson. So now here it is again. So we said the petrol price increase with 20%. What will the new price be? The original price is 100%. The increase is 20%. So it means that the new price will be 120%. So we take the original price, times it by 120%, which is 1,2, and that gives us 17 rand 34. So the new price will then be 17.34. Okay, so now back to example 7. So now adding 45% to the cost price, we have to multiply the cost price with 145% to give us this 290 rand. The inverse of multiplying is dividing. So therefore 290 rand divided by 145%. Calculate the work, 290 divided by 1,45 gives us 200 rand. So the cost price of this frying pan is 200 rand. And coincidentally, the owner of the store will make 90 rand profit on each pan that he sells. Okay. A certain store has given 70% discount on all its products. If the price on the tag of a pair of trousers is 120 rand, so this is a new tag after the, dis the discount, what was its price before the discount? So the, the original price of the product is, or the, yeah, the original price is 100%. The selling price is 100% minus the percentage discount. So we only have to pay 30% of the original price, which is a a very small amount that's a very nice discount okay now to calculate the selling price we will do the opposite of example 3 method 2 of day 2's lesson so here it is again at a seasonal sale the store offers 25 percent discount what will an item cost that used to be 700 rand so what will you pay for an item that used to be 700 rand the 700 Rand is 100%. If I subtract the discount, I only need to pay 75% of the original amount. So 700 times 0.75 is 525 Rand. So the price will decrease to 525. So now back again to example 8. So the original amount times 30% gives us 120. So what is that original amount? Remember the inverse of timesing is dividing. So we will go 120 divided by 30% or 120 divided by 0, 0,3 naught gives us 400. So the original amount of the pair of trousers was 400 rand. 